Salt and sodium. When people talk about food and nutrition, they often confuse the words salt and sodium. Salt or sodium chloride is a combination of two minerals, 40% sodium and 60% chloride. Therefore, sodium is a part of salt. For example, in 2.5 grams of salt, there is one gram of sodium. Sodium is considered the unhealthy part of salt, but in fact, it is an important nutrient for many reasons. Along with potassium, it regulates water balance in our body, makes muscles and nerves function, maintains blood volume, helps to maintain our body temperature, and is present in every cell of our body. It is important to have a small amount of salt regularly because it helps balance out the body. Sodium that comes from salt is used in our food for flavor or for preservation. In general, processed foods provide the major part of sodium in the diet. However, most processed foods have too much salt or other sodium compounds, which are not good for our health. These foods include potato chips, canned tomato sauce, salty snacks, canned vegetables, soups, crackers, corn chips, condiments. Ketchup, mayonnaise, salad dressing, soy sauce, and other sauces, hot dogs, processed cheese, sausages, bacon, and soda, among others. Having natural foods is the best idea, but it is not always easy to avoid processed foods in daily life. If we have too much salt, we will probably have high blood pressure. Kidney diseases and also cardiovascular diseases like strokes and heart attacks. So whenever we go to the supermarket, we should get used to reading labels on the products we buy. For instance, on a can of tomato sauce or on a pack of salty snacks. We will certainly be alarmed to see the high levels of sodium contained in them.